All right. Uh, this is day two. Yeah. In uh, Burundi, mm -hmm. uh, we are thankful for what uh, God is doing today. It uh, it didn't rain, so thank you for your prayers. Mm -hmm. So we were able to start on time. Yeah. And uh, we had some new people today. Today we had a total of uh, twenty-eight. So we had a total of twenty-eight. Uh, there were some uh, extra new people. Uh, some came today and they were not there yesterday because of the rain so they were able to make it today so that was great mm -hmm. and uh, there were some too that came because they had uh, their friends who and attended mm -hmm. uh, told them the amazing uh, training that we are having and they were telling him I need I think you have to come and hear for yourself so we end uh, an extra like two people who came and who are not invited now if you can see where these people are coming from, because when we are standing at the mountain where the church is, they can show us like two mountains far. Mm. And these people are walking and sometimes it's raining. You can see the dedication that yeah. uh, they are having. Yeah, actually, yeah. Actually, now you mentioning about that. Yes, it, it was amazing just like again well yesterday mm. to see that yes it rained now this was not just more rain very heavy rain mm. and you'll find you know people there and most of them these are not young people mm. these are, 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 are older people approximately around uh, 70 yeah 70 60 uh, so, so, yeah so and, and they have walked so so that really mm. uh, showed the passion well wow. mm -hmm. yeah also one thing that uh, amazed me is we arrived there at around uh, uh nine or a quarter past nine and we found around uh 15 of the pastors standing there outside waiting outside the church so this tells you the anger that these people are having to hear uh, what we are teaching yeah uh so today uh, today was uh, a unique day and again just like what we say that all days are different mm. uh in the training so today was a unique day and uh we <laughs> most of the times as we were teaching i think we had to be diverted a little bit from the training to now handle leadership matters mm. uh, because some of these guys so we are training uh, theology but they stop us in mm. the middle and they're like mm. you guys how do we even read mm, the bible read the bible so that we can get to understand mm. uh, uh to us that was that was very uh, touching that mm. uh, you know you would think that this is basic mm. uh, pastors have to uh no. to know how to read the bible mm. but uh these wonderful men of god are struggling with uh with even understanding the bible itself they uh, they are oral learners yeah uh they have not had any theological training mm. and, and 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 hey the pastor who is saying this he has over 870 870 membership and uh uh he is asking some question like can you guys tell us how to read the bible from genesis to revelation how do we do this and then he raised an, a very important question on parenting because he was like, now, if we have believed, we need to have works. Now, how do we earn the works and yet we are having families? So we end again to deviate on parenting for God's glory, just touching a little bit of it to enlighten them because we could not uh, put that aside because it was coming from a pastor who is pastoring 870 members and almost 1,000 uh, uh, Sunday school. So it, it was great to see that their mindset 